I'm off. I'll see you later. And not you forget Sally's taking you to the cafe later. <sighs> How could I? It's all I've been thinking about. Hey, less cheeks. You're not that bad. If it, if it gets too much, just pop your headphones in. I'm proud of you. You know that. What for? Taking the mickey out of your ex-wife? Oh, the way you've been handling all this. <laughs> Don't know about that. I've had my moments. Yeah, well, you've just got to hold it together till after the trial, and then hopefully that low-life core in his mates will get what's coming to him. Well, we'll see. You know, there's a rumour that Tommy Orpington's been called as a character witness for him. Is he supposed to be this up-and-coming footballer? Tommy O? That's mad. Yep. But unless all the jury's weather county fans, I can't see it making much difference. Mm -hmm. No, I guess not. Yeah. How was the shake? Really good, thanks. Do you know, I've hardly had a word out of him. He's been that busy trying to polish it off in one go. Looks like you did a pretty good job. She's really brave, isn't she? You know, after everything that's happened, Abby is and all. Yeah, she is. They both are. It's not been easy for them. And I'm sure it's not been easy for you or Kevin either. I hear her crying sometimes at night when I'm in my room. Is that why you're so quiet? Because you're worried about Abby? A bit, yeah. Also, because I heard her and my dad talking about the trial, and they said that Tommy Orpington was going to be a character witness for Corey. I looked it up, and it said it means he's going to be on his side. Really? Why would he want Corey to get away with it? I thought he was supposed to be a good person. I'm sure he is. And I'm sure if he knew what really happened, he wouldn't be doing it. Look, you don't need to worry about it. It's going to be OK. And so is Abby. So, is it a social call? I just wanted to see how you were after the screaming match with your fella. Yeah, that. I'm sorry it happened. Look, you don't need to apologise. It's OK. I'm OK. Right, seeing as you're here, I know it's early, but you fancy a cheeky glass of wine? <laughs> yes, stuff it. Why not? Glad you said that. Uh, sorry about all that mess. I was just clearing it up. Oh, late. Honestly, you want to see our place? You can hardly move for paperwork. Yeah, Imran's really thrown himself into that trial, isn't he? I have never seen him so driven or worried. And what about you? Well, I'm sort of caught in the middle, aren't I? I know that you and a lot of people are upset about him representing Kelly, and I get why. I don't think she killed Seb, but then again, she's not completely innocent in all of this either. But you're still going to support her and Imran? I have to. So, uh, does Imran think he can win? Even if he does, there aren't going to be any real winners, are there? Oh, here he is, the human cannonball. I've just seen something really weird on the internet. What have I told you about looking at them sites? Mum, I'm serious. What is it? Corey's identity's been leaked on a site about that footballer, Tommy Orpington. By who? You're back early. Have you finished them bread pads already? What's she doing here? I went to the garage looking for you. We need to talk. What about? Corey's identity's been leaked online. On her fan site for Tommy Orpington. Did you do it? No, I didn't. Well, who else knew about it? Cos someone did. It was me. What? I don't believe it. Why would you go and do something like that? I heard you say he was going to be a character witness for Corey. When I told Sally, she reckoned that if Tommy knew what he was really like, he wouldn't do it. I was trying to help. Fine. So people are going to know what a scumbag he is. Good. No, Abby, it's not good. His identity is supposed to be secret. So now that it's been leaked, it could mess up the whole trial. 